basically we, we count the grouse because we need to know how many days we can have shooting so we can manage it. You want to know what's there before, before you head out. With the shooting, you don't, no one wants to overshoot the grouse more and ruin it for the year after. Because if, if you overshoot it, you can end up damaging them all for two, three years to grow the numbers back. You uh, generally try for early mornings just to catch the grouse when they've first woken up. And the idea is just to walk the same route, similar time every year, and count what jumps up in front of you. You can work your average brood out, so you know how well they've bred, you know what hasn't bred, and then you'll uh, compare it to your records every year, and you've, you've got an average of what your moor's doing, and if it's growing, if the, it's been a bad season. A lot of people go counting to, uh, to know what they can expect, and if they compare the records year on year, keepers are really good at estimating the average bags they'll get. It's, it's basically just so it, no one's doing any damage and we know what to expect sort of thing. We use dogs because well, this time of year grouse can still be sticky, they can sit tight. So we use the dogs to scent them obviously because we, we, we won't know they're there and the dogs can smell them. They want, they want to have a good nose on them, so they walk up, flush the brood so you can count it. So obviously you don't want a dog that's running miles ahead. You want to be close enough to the dog so you can see what they jump. You want it to be a nice steady dog. It doesn't really matter with the breed, as long as it's well behaved and it can be brought back at the peep of a whistle, you've, you've got a chance of counting what's going up. You don't, you don't want a wild one. The last two seasons haven't been great for us here. We've, we've had a lot of cold weather in May the last two years and it's killed a lot of the young chicks. We do look at the counts and we will compare them, but this year I think we are going to have a good year. I've seen best numbers we've seen in, I'd say, four seasons to be fair.